Hi, welcome back to the channel. I wanted to take you along this evening and uh, bring you along for our evening tours. I haven't done this yet and wanted to show you all what we do pretty much on a regular routine basis here on the hobby farm. First thing I like to do is get the goats and their grain ready. Then we let them loose, and they uh, sure got their routine down. They know exactly what's going on. And poor Axel gets stuck inside. <laughs> Sunshine goes up on the milk stand. Come on, Axel. Sunshine's waiting for her grain and to be milked. Get up there. All right, we'll set you up there and uh, we'll get the milking. bucket of uh, hot soapy water here. Clean our udders. Usually uh, squirt two squirts out of each udder just to clear the, the milk duct there of any bacteria or anything. And then we uh, get the milk and she's a really good milker. Always stands pretty still for me. And uh, really gives us a lot of milk. I usually get uh, a solid quart, quart and a half every evening. So very thankful for her with that. We sure enjoy it. This, uh, earlier this spring into you know, early summer, I should say late spring, early summer, when we were milking all three does, it would take me a good uh, 20 to 30 minutes to milk, and I would do that twice a day. I was getting over a little, little over a gallon of milk a day, which was way too much for us, so I dried up the other two does, and thankfully she still produces a lot of milk for us. So some of you might wonder, you know, if we pasteurize our milk, um, which we don't, we drink it raw. And you know, I, I do filter it and immediately chill it after filtering. And we really enjoy it. You might be able to see that. And of course my barn buddies are always out with me. Never leave my side. It's a blessing, but at that same time they're in the way a lot. <laughs>
and I give them another scoop of green. Get in there, maybe you'd be nice. You all probably won't be able to see there very well, but we got Sweetie Pie in there. And Jasper will come as soon as she goes in her stall. She likes to boss him around until she gets in there. Oh, you're bad. Little attitude girl. So I give the goats two flakes of hay every night and uh, give everyone fresh hay in the morning. And you can see them here, they'll start getting bossy about the little bit of grain left in there. And... <laughs> Same thing every night. Daisy uh, kind of rules the roost. That's Daisy if you didn't know. <clears throat> She's the only one with the horns there as the adult does and then uh, Snickers and Major, we try, uh, tried disbudding. Uh, I'm never going to do that again. <laughs> it was a pretty terrible experience for me. And uh, the two little does, the black one here and the white one in the back, they uh, have their horns. So From here on out, we're going to leave the horns alone if we have any more uh, babies and uh, go with it like that. So. All right, well, I hope you all enjoyed our evening routine. Things don't change too much day to day here, so that's a good thing. But I uh, wanted to bring you all along. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. Um, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're not. And the new subscribers, welcome. I sure appreciate the support. Love hearing feedback from everyone. And uh, keep the comments coming. I really like them. like to talk to everyone and uh, sure appreciate it. So until next time, I hope you all take care and have a great New Year's. Be safe, spend time with the family, and enjoy it. We'll catch y'all next time on our high hilltops. Y'all take care.